Hey, how you guys doing? Um, for this week's video, um, I'm going to talk about a recent purchase. I, I purchased a new Sony DVD player. Um, we're not going to do an overall review, but only really one feature, which is which I like a lot, uh, and I'm going to be talking about now. So uh, basically, I, I bought a, uh, a lot of new DVDs, and so when I put it in the old Sony DVD player, uh, I had a lot of problems. Uh, it played for a while, but then it would stop. I couldn't get it to restart the DVD. So I went uh, went out and I wanted to purchase uh, a new Sony DVD player. I basically wanted to get pretty much the same model or something very close to the same model. Um, they didn't sell the old ones, so I bought this new one, which is almost looks identical except with a couple of new features or something like that. Um, and I'll show you, this is the box right here, just to give you an idea what it looks like. And um, one of the newest features is this, oh, let me tell you the model number, by the way. Um, of course, Sony DVD player, model number DVP, SR510H, just to uh, give you an idea what it is. And then this is the new, um, HDMI output 1080p upscaling right here. Now what that means is a lot of the older um, TV and movies were shot in 4x3 ratio until of course today um, we basically shoot it in uh, widescreen format uh, like 16x9 um, 16 by, 16 by ratio basically which fits most um, the modern HD televisions or even possibly the 4K. It's basically 16 by 9 type of picture ratio. Of course, with any upscaling picture, um, it's not going to give you a better quality. In this case, it takes that older um, 4x3 ratio and upscales it to 1080p. Um, and you're not going to get a better picture. It's not going to technically make it into um, HD quality. It's just upscaling. So you can utilize um, full screen of your HD television. Of course, if you, normally when you play uh, four, 14, or excuse me, 4 by 3 ratio on an HD TV, you see black bars on the right and left side. So basically, it fills in the whole screen. It usually makes for a better... Uh, viewing, viewing experience, but keep in mind you're not going to get a better quality picture. In fact, you may may degrade slightly because you're basically stretching it out, and you may get some pixelation or something in the picture. Usually, it's it's not um, a bad experience, really. You can't. You, most people would barely notice. They're more worried about just putting on the screen, getting a full screen, and, and, and things like that. So I'm actually going to uh, give you some examples right now. I'm going to show you um, a lot of modern HD TVs. You can um, take the input signal and you can um, actually stretch it out. You can either stretch it out like from a 4x3 to widescreen. Um, you can zoom in. There's different things you can do, which to me isn't the best way of doing it is it often stretches it out too much and makes it look wonky. Um, and then, of course, I'm going to show you um, the upscaling feature of the Sony DVD player, which I think does a better job. You don't get that um, warped look to the picture. And then we're going to kind of compare the two a little bit. So uh, we're going to be doing that right now. Okay, here we are um, playing a uh, DVD in 4x3 ratio on a HD TV. And most modern uh, HD TVs, you can change the picture size uh, to zoom it in. And I'll show you some of this right here now. Um, here we got it stretched out um, and zoomed in and uh, back again. And uh, now we're going to set resolution size using the just the DVD player. Uh, we're going to go into settings and custom. And from there, you're going to go into the screen setup. And here it's set on 16 by 9, which will actually show you the black bars on the right and left side. Now, to set it to full screen for 4 by 3 ratio, just like so, as you can see, uh, it, it does it shows it full screen. And then we're going to set the 4 by 3 
output to normal and you can choose um, full normal or auto I normally go to auto and then from there you can show your picture as I mentioned before I, I typically don't like using the um, TV to uh, to adjust the picture if it's not centered right or something because it ends up stretching it out um, kind of warping the picture I guess you could say and so this is um, the HDTV um, stretching out from 4 by 3 to ratio to 16 by 9 which is uh, it'll work it's okay but um, I'm going to compare that with the uh, DVD and you'll notice it's not quite as stretched out and possibly a little warped looking now um, this one's a uh, picture upscale from uh, 4 by 3 to um, 16 by 9 using the DVD player and um, I don't know if you noticed the transition from the old to the new picture that um, it's not quite as stretched and zoomed in as well and um, I, I think the Sony DVD player does a much better or does a better job uh, than using your TV alone um, so I, I definitely like the upscale feature from uh, 4 by 3 to uh, HD 1080p version so thanks for watching and see you guys later.